Good morning, good morning, good morning. <coughs> How you doing this morning? How you doing this morning? Well, this is this is day five. Day five. I usually do three to four. But I said let me go and get out of here. It's a nice morning. And get this done. Remember I said, it's your pace, your time, and your race. So, I ain't out here trying to beat somebody. I'm just doing it for me. You got anything that you do, you can't do it for nobody else. You got to do it for you. I don't care whether that's business whether that's personal, whatever journey you're on, you got to do it for you. Because that's the end of the day. It's about you. It's not about anybody else in their journey. Some people may be on the same journey, but God takes us through our journey a little differently. Because my journey doesn't look like your journey does not mean I don't have any success in my journey. I need y'all to get that. I need y'all to get that. Because it's too many times people say, I'm successful. You should do what I do. But that's not the way God taking me. He's not taking me to mimic anybody's journey see me getting out here I had to do this for me not because somebody said gee you need to that's what anything you do and I'm I'm gonna be on the wait for a minute you if you need to lose some weight you know it but guess what you can't get out here whether you outside walking inside walking changing your eating habits you cannot do that for nobody but you when you get ready to do it guess what you gonna do it with no questions asked cause you ready you sick and tired of being sick and tired of being winded not being able to breathe Have all these things, health has just come up because you are carrying too much weight. And I'll tell you a little story. Long before I started losing weight, it was a joke in the family. Uh, I was the youngest and the biggest. I took that from my granddad. I don't take that from nobody else. I don't take that from nobody else. But until I got ready to lose it, it wasn't going nowhere. So I'm just telling you, whatever journey you own, don't try to mimic nobody else's journey. Because it's not going to work. It's not going to work. Because our journeys are not the same. I'm sorry, I'm trying to cross the street, y'all. Our journeys are not the same. So, it's your pace, your race, your time. Those three things, remember that and put your in front of it. You talking about you. It's your race, your pace, your time. I don't care what's happening. Do it at your pace. Somebody might be uh, walking a 5K. And those of y'all that know, 5K is three miles. You don't have to be the first one to get in as long as you finish the race. And I've walked a few 5Ks before. I wasn't the first one to get in. Wasn't the second, third. I might have been the, been the 50th or the 80th. But I finished the race. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Finish your race. Finish your race. 
finish your journey. Your weight loss journey, your business journey, your spiritual journey. This your journey. It has nothing to do with nobody else. This yours. This is something that if you really want to get it done, and I mean get it done and don't stop. Because I, like I said, this day five. Go to God and ask him to give you what you need to get out here. Or, or, or do your exercise. I, I'm an outside person. Do your exercise and get your temple, to, temple right. Because I'm a firm believer. We can't be effective in the kingdom if our temple is not right. If we sick all the time. If we, if we have weight, weight issues. <laughs> we can't be effective. See, that's what I say. You know, maybe I'll know some more than I do. But that's just my relationship with God. Because I asked him. When I first started back walking not too long ago, give me what I need to get out of here, God. I might not walk in the neighborhood all the time, but I walk on my lunch. I walk on my lunch while I'm at work. And people be like, gee, where you walking? I say, I walk down Congress, Mississippi, back up a mid, back to Lamar. It's like, dog. I said, yeah, I'm tired, but guess what? I got it in. I got it in. So, most times we, we have to push ourselves. You have to push yourself. If you know you got a goal to meet, push yourself to get it done. Push yourself to get it done. I'm walking on this narrow street. Y'all, please forgive me. Uh, this is Greenway Drive. I'm walking on. You know, I like to document where I am just in case I need y'all to call the folk. But anyway, um, I just want to come on and encourage you and just remind you, this is your race, your pace, your time. Remember those two, three, those three things and you're going to be all right. Thank y'all for chiming in. If I said anything that helped y'all, that pushed you. Share the video. Share the video. But y'all be blessed. I'm going to finish this. And I think I'm going to push on down 18 and go on back to the house. Y'all be blessed. G loves you. Your pace. Your race. Your time. See you later.